Let's check on Atreus. Well, good to see you making new friends. Ain't that me old near pack a punch? You know we made that hammer, right? You have mentioned it. I know that. Wasn't ever sure you were listening. At least it was good to see the axe hold her own. Kind of the point, after all. Ha! This'll get you home. No use trying to bifrog your way around the realms. Odin's got them locked down tight. Or ain't you noticed? Hey, one last thing there, Tiny. If you got Aesir at your door, then I reckon your protection staves busted. Once you chase Odin off, you got another place to lay your head tonight? And I don't mean that talking, though. We will not abandon my home. Oh, yeah? And what's to stop the all fucker from spying on you? Or Raven pecking your house to splinters while you're asleep in it? Nothing, that's what. You go get your boy, and I'll speak to a certain someone about putting you up at his place in a pinch. I was about to look for you. Are you hurt? Are you? What does he want? To uh, pay for the roof. And he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I told him no. Obviously. Good. Why were you searching for Tia? If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth from me? I wanted to tell you. I really did, but now that you know, there's something you should see. No! Just trust me, you'll want to. Trust! You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin. Or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our backs. And I think I know how. Sir. So we gather your things.
Are you ready? Go. Change your bastard. Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. The door didn't see anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. Do you think he knows all the Giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? <laughs> what happened here? So close to home. Are Raiders warring with one another now? Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. More over here, and fresh. Did they all get in while the stay was down? That, or Odin cocked up the protection spell altogether. What do you see? Hmm, just animal tracks. Burn this bramble off. It'll be quicker. <laughs> Almost to the bridge. Oh, guess the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. <sighs> dreams. <laughs> hey. Try using your blades to pull this down. Please. <laughs> Whoa. That one's still alive. No. Look closer. Oh, it is it too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours? See something down there? What was that? Something strong and dangerous. Be on guard. Oh yeah, being all the way on guard. <laughs> now, just need to find a way around. Behind you! Watch out! <laughs> <laughs> 
Whatever it is, it works fast. Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the Giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead? Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. Right? He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the Giants' greatest ally. So... Enough. Uh, that pillar wasn't in the way last time I came. Huh. 
Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the giant. So he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. What do you know? You'll see soon. Imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Many dead here. We should keep moving. Later! Isn't it nice how Fimblewinter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. <laughs>
Isn't it nice how Fimblewinter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. has gotten rather good at that. <laughs> Yet another grizzly scene. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Speak 
Winter Freya, the raiders torn out and barging in, and now stalkers playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Father, the shield Mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now... Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps. Later. <laughs> Come on, we can get in this way. Atreus. Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realize. How do you always know how to find those?
Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. Ah, things collapsing on a regular basis in these parts. Fimble Winter wears down all things, even stone. That should help. There we go. Come on. Watching? Well, that's new. Come on. Atreus, wait! Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati? The wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. It's not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then, the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse. I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir. Can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait! We are going home. Wait! I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? 
How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard, anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. They mention... black smoke and the bleeding earth. But... We can never figure out exactly... We? Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. it. It wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the Bleeding Earth? Sounds like a mine, aye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps? Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their minds did burst black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it, then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine? So? What now? Lad, even if we consider looking for Tyr, how do you have us getting to Svartalfheim? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. <laughs> 